Following nine years of marriage, John Richardson and Lucy Beaumont have announced their divorce. The news was revealed in a joint statement by the couple on Friday, two days after the premiere of the fifth season of their comedy series Meet the Richardsons. The couple has a seven-year-old daughter named Elsie Louise. When their romance was included in the 2020 at-home mockumentary, the couple said it helped their off-screen relationship. After meeting through fellow comedian Royce and Connady, John and Lucy started dating in 2013. They got married in April 2015 and welcomed their baby in September of the same year. According to Lucy, who wrote about their first meeting in Drinking Custard, Diary of a Confused Mum, they hit it off right immediately. She gave the explanation that she had recently relocated to London in order to pursue a career in comedy, and that Royson had asked her to a show at Kingston upon Thames The Fighting Cox. I sensed the presence of someone behind me. I was quite sure John knew I was crushing on him, so I was so close to passing out, she wrote. Lucy said, It was quite symbolic as we have been fighting like cocks ever since. In an interview with the Sunday Times, the couple went on their first date two weeks after initially meeting at the gig, and she wrote in her biography that something quite weird happened. The comic added, John dropped me off at the train station in his car, and we exchanged phone numbers. Suddenly, I saw my wife flashing in large LED letters on his dashboard through Bluetooth. I've never exited a car that quickly. When I called my friend Jackie, she calmly informed me that he must be a psychopath and advised me to return to Hull to live with her after leaving London right away. Since it debuted in 2020, the two have starred in the At Home Mockumentary series Meet the Richardsons, which is about their relationship. Just this week, on April 8th, its fifth series debuted on Dave. They play exaggerated versions of themselves and taunt each other with humor during the show. Lucy's work in the comedy program earned her a nomination for a 2023 BAFTA TV award in the female performance category. Days after the fifth series premiered, the comedic pair revealed on Friday that they were splitting after nine years of marriage. As they discussed how important it was to them to prioritize their child, John and Lucy maintained that their split had been amicable. After nine years of marriage, we would like to announce that we have separated. The couple said in a statement to the PA news agency that we have decided to divorce and part ways in a cooperative and friendly manner that we would ask that our privacy be respected during this delicate time to preserve our daughter's well-being. As our primary concern is helping her through this challenging adjustment, we won't be commenting further. It's been nice, but I see comments on social media and people don't seem to realize it's not genuine. Lucy admitted last year. She said that viewers frequently do not comprehend that their fighting is not real. I don't henpeck. If I had treated him badly in real life, we wouldn't have survived this long. A smug couple who are in love, live in a wonderful home, have a steady job, and have a cute little child is the last thing you want to see. Who would like to watch that? If that's how we were going to be, then I wasn't doing it. We'll present the other side, in which we're incessantly antagonistic. It's a more accurate representation. Although the world we live in is a little strange, I believe that people still feel like they can identify with it, which is positive. When Lucy first discussed her partnership with her husband in January of last year, she said, We really wanted to make something that people could relate to, and we like working together and enjoy Meet the Richardsons. Meet the Richardsons is really a way for us to turn awkward situations into comedic moments. You can see this in the studio when someone starts talking as though they're going to hit someone, but they quickly realize it's all nonsense when they see how much fun we have having. The most recent season of Meet the Richardsons, which premiered this week, may be the last, Lucy previously revealed to OK. Last month, she said, this will probably be the last one, and we're going out on a high. When asked what they had learned while filming John and Lucy's odd marriages, Lucy continued, We've learned that all couples have ongoing tensions and beef with each other. Everybody is identical. John went on, How you handle problems is more important than having problems or not having problems. The ideal pair does not exist. Hillary Whitehall and Michael Whitehall were incredibly cruel to one another 
and it is now a part of their marriage vocabulary. Following its triumph for Best Comedy at the Broadcast Digital Awards 2022, Meet the Richardsons was confirmed to get a fifth season renewal last year. Yes, we have another series commissioned, Lucy stated in an interview with The Sun at the time. The plan for the upcoming season is to do a sitcom with humor, a la heartbeat, although John wants to win an award because he's planning to retire shortly. He therefore desires a more abstract and weird sitcom. Each of us then goes out and brainstorms ideas for our own comedy, which we then present to a focus group before coming back to the group. The pair moved during the fourth series of television, which included guest performers Adrian Childs and Ben Elton. A number of well-known figures, including Ben Shepard, Kimberly Wyatt, Lee Mack, Alexander Armstrong, Greg Wallace, Stephen Mangan, Amanda Abington, Dick and Dom, Adrian Childs, Nigel Havers, Cheryl Baker, and the Cheeky Girls, were confirmed to be making appearances in the new series last month. Even before the fourth series aired, the fifth season was confirmed. In this season, Lucy's career is turbocharged by her BAFTA nomination and she's getting offered shows from the very huge to the really odd, says Dave. John is content with Lucy's success, he has no desire to compete, and he consents when he is losing. Thus, while Lucy is preoccupied with Taskmaster, Bake Off, and Celebrity Chinese Whispers, John is preparing to leave television by taking a last, lucrative job as the host of a brand new daytime quiz show. At home, meantime, it's more difficult than ever to keep up with the neighbors when a global celebrity and her partner move in next door. Lucy is eager for John to accompany her to Glastonbury to celebrate her 40th birthday. Never will he consent to that. Will they both come to the conclusion that five seasons of Meet the Richardsons is sufficient, though? Together with Tim Reed, Peter Kay's car share scribe, the couple wrote the show before it debuted on the channel in 2020. When the couple appeared together on Celebrity Gogglebox, they received a lot of positive feedback. In addition to her work with her spouse, Lucy has appeared on several panel shows, such as Have I Got News For You, The Last Leg, and Would I Lie To You? On the other hand, John is well known for his roles as team captain on 8 out of 10 cats and panel show appearances. In addition to hosting on BBC Radio 6 Music in the past, he started the panel program John Richardson, Ultimate Warrior on Dave in 2018 and it ran for two series.